Also tonight, UTEP fans gathering early today to cheer on their team. That's right, and ABC7's Tony Gutierrez was at a watch party and he spoke with many UTEP minor fans. He joins us live from the district on Mesa and Tony, what did they tell you? Well, Rosemary Sam, despite the results, fans in attendance of this watch party cheered on for their UTEP minors as this was a sight they had not seen in a very long time. I hope Western Kentucky is ready because it's over tonight. With high expectations and a dream in hand, UTEP minor fans got together to cheer on for their team. Man, UTEP basketball has been a part of my life since I was a kid. As young as I can remember, Stephon Jackson, Randy Culpepper, you know, going to those games as a kid, it's great. And it's been a while since we had that success. So finally, to see us getting a conference championship, I mean, there's no better way to do it than to celebrate with the people of El Paso. With ups and downs throughout the game, the passion from those present could be felt, just like this moment when the Miners took their first lead of the game. Despite moments like this, things would soon turn sour for me as the Miners started to fall behind. When we took the lead, I didn't feel that comfortable because I knew the Hilltoppers, they had a really good chance. This game was all about runs. So then at the end, they pulled off the greatest one and they came out victorious. Knowing that the team went this far, fans believe there's nothing to complain about as they are proud of their team. My dad says it's gonna, we're going to go to the championship each next year again. Definitely because I know we lost our seniors, but it's going to be a whole new chapter. Now following this heartbreaking loss, fans told me they remain hopeful as they see a bright future for this team. For now, reporting outside the district in West El Paso, Tony Gutierrez, ABC7.